Okay, with all this talk about Tesla going bankrupt, right now it is March 29, 2018. Let's go back and revisit what happened over the past few months with this Trump tariff on imported solar panels because as you know tesla makes their stuff in the united states the gigafactory 2 just opened in buffalo new york recently and so they don't they're not subject to this tariff so actually what this tariff did maybe it hurt other businesses that were sourcing their, their panels from overseas but tesla has actually been helping them even though they're, they're on the verge of apparently going out of business or at least running out of money let's look at this well here this article profiles a company called uh, SunPower, and apparently they must, and they don't say it in here, they must source their panels from China or wherever. Some other other country, they manufacture them uh, at a lower labor rate or something like that. So um, anyway, this company is saying they're going to be tremendously hurt and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But of course, this is not saying anything about Tesla. And look at this. I just love the news. Why can't you guys get this? I mean, as a solar company, we are devastated to learn Trump has imposed a 30% tariff on solar panels, virtually killing the solar industry. No, it has not killed the solar industry. It has killed now one solar, maybe, who is getting their panels from overseas, but has not killed the industry. This is fake news, misinformation, etc. Just kind of like Trump says, even though I'm not a Trump supporter, I'll tell you that's not even a true statement. That's just an outright lie. Everybody says that Trump's lying, but everybody else is lying too. So you can't have it both ways, folks. Anyway, and I'm not going to get into politics. By the way, I'm apolitical, so don't try to pin me on anything because I'm not. You're not going to be able to. Donald Trump's tariffs on panels will will cost U.S. solar industry thousands of jobs. Yes, it will. Some people, some some business this yeah, businesses that are getting their panels from overseas will be hurting. Of course they will. Yes, they will. But this is helping American businesses, which is Tesla is an American company, and. That's really going to help them. They don't really see none of these articles mention Tesla. Well, it'll help Tesla. Nope. I don't see it anywhere in here. Do you see it? Nothing. I don't see it anything. Anywhere. And this last article was going back to all the way to the beginning. Okay. Major blow to renewable energy. Energy. No, it's a major blow to people that source renewable energy products from other countries, not from people who manufacture their products here in the United States, such as Tesla. Again, this helps Tesla. So why isn't Tesla being helped right now? Why is Tesla going out of business? I don't know. And why are we getting this video popping up? I don't know either. Okay, <laughs> so this should really be helping keep Tesla afloat, yet um, obviously right now they're saying the company's going out of business. And everyone's focusing on Tesla as a vehicle manufacturer, which they are, but they're also a renewable energy company. So they are a solar equipment manufacturer, okay? And they are not focusing on that right now. This should be helping Tesla. So let's see how this plays out. Um, I think that it will work in Tesla's favor. I think that this will help to keep Tesla in business. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I look forward to reading what you have to say. Thanks.